So, as I said, when I look through the literature, what are these risk factors? Well, they're actually very similar to heart disease. And it's really no surprise. The most recent theory about MS comes from um, Professor Angelique Corthales in, uh, in New York. And she's published this not long ago in Quarterly Reviews in Biology. And uh, her very well elucidated theory is that MS is essentially kind of heart disease of the brain, if you like. It's just the same sort of process. It's a result of not being able to regulate how we break down fats properly. And the fats in our diet are a key in determining both heart disease and MS. And she really argues that, that um, it's not so much an immune system dysfunction. The immune system problem is, is kind of secondary to this problem regulating fats in our diet. So she's saying that refined foods and fats are really our big problem uh, in terms of what's causing MS. And most recent research is supporting that, that MS actually not only has a very significant immune component, it has a very significant degenerative component. So degeneration is a really key issue, which is the kind of process we get with ageing. Things break down. So how do we stop things degenerating? We, we know how to do that from other research. We need to exercise. We need to eat more polyunsaturated fat. We need to get a bit of sun exposure um, and so on.